today, let us just celebrate the return of Kenya to international football. I'm happy that now our league can proceed, and the league has already done two rounds. Our league can now proceed with our players and our clubs confident that they are now participating in a legitimate competition that will lead the winners of this league to participate in CAF authorized or CAF sanctioned competitions. I have also indicated to FIFA that the government of Kenya is keen, extremely keen, on certain substantive developments. Number one, we are very keen to launch a program for talent sporting and talent development. And so we are going to see a lot of action in terms of grassroots development of football. You are going to see a lot of work going on around the Kenya Academy of Sports. Today, the Kenya Academy of Sports is only an academy in name. But it's not an academy that you can look at and be confident that it's a, it's a platform for developing talent. But very soon, we are launching something mega. I'll be inviting you to a mega launch where we are launching a program on how to support and develop talent. We have the Vision 2030 that at the very minimum, Harambe Stars must play at the World Cup 2030. That is the minimum. If we can make it to the World Cup 2026, that would be great. But we are being realistic that with good investment, with good planning, with investment in talent development and running our football in a manner that is transparent, accountable, and with tenets of good governance, we can get Harambe Stars to the World Cup 2020, 2030 minimum. While in Doha to meet FIFA and CAF, I took time to watch a number of games. And from what I saw, on the pitch, that is a stage I want to see Kenyan, Kenyan boys displaying their talent. It is sad that our best football expert today, Michael Lunga, is only going to the stadia as a fan and not as a player to display his talent on the pitch. I want players playing for this country to get an opportunity to display their talent on that stage. And it's an amazing experience. It's an amazing experience where we need to get Kenya being part of that, uh, of that great experience.